Welcome to our Angular 4 Troubleshooting Guide. Today, we're tackling a frustrating error that many developers encounter. The expression changed after it has been checked error. One of our viewers has reached out with a specific issue regarding event emitters in their child module. They say every event emitter triggers this error and they can't seem to find a fix. Let's break down the problem and explore some solutions together. Welcome back to another technical video. We're gonna go through the question, the answer, and I hope that you get the solution. Guys, I hope you stay crazy just a little bit like me and work your way through to getting to that end resolution. Let's get started. The error you're encountering, expression changed after it has been checked error, occurs when Angular detects that a value has changed after it has already checked the component's view. In your case, this error is triggered by the event emitter in the ng on changes lifecycle hook. When you emit the grouping tab valid change event, it causes Angular to reevaluate the component's state. To resolve this issue, you can use Angular's change detector ref to manually mark the component for change detection. This ensures that Angular is aware of the changes you are making. Next, inject change detector ref into your component's constructor. After emitting the event, call detect changes to update the view. Finally, ensure that your set validators function does not directly modify the grouping tab valid property during the change detection cycle. Instead, consider using set timeout to defer the change. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To resolve the expression changed after it has been checked error in Angular 4, you can use change detection strategy. Simply import it and apply the onPush strategy to your component. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To resolve the expression changed after it has been checked error in Angular 4, you can avoid using set timeout. Instead, inject change detector ref into your component and use its mark for check method to notify Angular of upcoming changes. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. This user is exploring the expression changed after it has been checked error in Angular. They believe it's meant to prevent feedback loops. They suggest that instead of passing values between parent and child components, it's better to handle logic in a service. The user notes that the provided code doesn't create a loop, but Angular rechecks values at the end of the cycle. They highlight that the variable grouping tab valid directly feeds back. They recommend handling changes to age in the parent component suggesting a click event to change age directly.
the user provides a code snippet for the change age method and shares a modified Plunker link that resolves the error. I hope that video helped find the resolution you're looking for. If it did, guys, I'd appreciate it if you could hit subscribe. Until the next time that you need more technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers. Yeah.